Hey everybody, we're back again for another Technique Tuesday. Still going over the hinge. So last week we did the kettlebell deadlift and today we're gonna to progress onto the RDL or Romanian deadlift. So this exercise, it can be done with dumbbells. If you have a barbell, that's fine. You can even do kettlebells. Doesn't really matter, but just for today, we are gonna be using dumbbells. So I have my dumbbells at the bottom right now and I'm just gonna kind of get into my stance. So again, I like to have my feet a little bit narrower. Uh, I'm going to kind of screw my feet into the ground. I'm going to just have a little slight bend in the knees. Um, so as I screw my feet in the ground, knees are out, hips are right underneath me, keeping that rib cage down, I'm going to tuck that chin. So as I pick up my dumbbells, I'm going to go through that same exact process, screw the feet, knees out, hips are right underneath my feet, ribs down, making that double chin. Now from here, I like to start with, so you can kind of see a side view, I just put a little slight bend in my knees. And then from here, I wanna try and keep my, uh, my lower leg as straight up as possible. So from here, I'm gonna think about sinking my hips back, going all the way down as far as I can. You can notice right here, I'm able to keep my back nice and flat the whole time. If I go a little further down, I start to round. So I know I just go right here, and I'm gonna come right back up. One thing that people tend to do is as they go down, they let their shoulders kind of sag down, so that makes you round your back. You want to make sure that when we start, our shoulders are down and back, and I'm going to maintain this position right here the whole time. Going down and back up. So a little front view from this. Starting right here, making that double chin. I'm going down, pushing my hips back, and coming up. Again, I'm going to give you one more side view. If you watch where my hands are, whether you're using a barbell or dumbbells, we want to make sure that we keep these nice and close to our body. If we end up going further out, that's going to put a lot of stress on that low back, and that's where an injury might happen. So we want to make sure that we're basically, I basically rub right down my legs the whole time. Going down, and then back up. So the RDL will be the next progression for or after the kettlebell deadlift or dumbbell deadlift. And then next week we're going to be going over the kettlebell swing.